And give me the life in the eyes. Alright. Or don't. Who's here? Can go. Come here. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's like Rose on the boat. What's up y'all welcome to this video today i'm out here in los Feliz, and i'm going to be photographing one of my friends along the way i'll be giving tips and tricks to help you to photograph your friends as well because when you're first starting out you're not shooting models you're not shooting actors you're typically shooting family and friends so i'm going to shoot one of my friends and show you what i do to make them feel comfortable and not regret the experience so let's get started all right so now it's time to meet my friend molly molly jump in what's up molly say hey to the people hey molly are you an actor no molly are you a model no molly do you like having your picture taken Sometimes. All right. She's doing me a favor today. Are you employed? Yes. She has a job. Hey, y'all, I'm telling you, real people, I know them. All right, let's get started. Look at those bright sunny days. The first tip I like to offer is to make the shooting experience feel like you're just hanging out with your friend. I hadn't seen Molly in a really long time before this shoot, COVID, and everyone trying to put their lives back together. And on top of people in LA being extremely busy because you know, life, jobs, socializing, the whole gambit. So for me and Molly, this really was an opportunity for us to catch up. And when it feels like the stakes aren't as high on the shoot, your subjects are able to relax and get into kind of a groove and they don't feel as self-conscious because they too feel like they're hanging out with one of their friends. And then kind of center yourself. Yep. And then I'm gonna come here, it's all even lighting. Oh, that's good. You kind of looking down how, how you are naturally. One, two, and three. Now just kind of turn your head to face me. Yeah, one, two, and three. Great. Make the experience a collaborative one. Before the shoot, I told her the location, the location I chose was closer to where she lives so it wouldn't be inconvenient for her. To kind of keep it casual. I just kind of said, wear something summery because it should be pretty warm. And she was like, got it easy it is a collaborative effort to make photographs and if your subject feels like they're a part of it it goes so much smoother let it flow a lot of times when i'm shooting molly i'm watching molly i'm watching how she naturally moves i don't want to overpose her so if i see her move in a way that i think is interesting i'll simply say hold that or i like that or if she starts to move in a direction that inspires an idea from me, I'll tell her, oh yes, that's good. Let's keep going with this. So I encourage my subject to move naturally in their own skin so that their photographs won't feel forced and they won't be stiff. All right, let me get cozy. And exhale, give me a deep breath and exhale on three. And let it out. Right. And give me the life in the eyes. All right. Or don't. <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> Look up my elbow in the air. No, this oh, elbow. Yeah. <laughs> Just on that lip. Yeah. All right. And then lift your eyes and then turn your head that direction a little bit. Your chin. Yep. All right. And one, two, and three. I feel like the green on green. So stand actually and come to this green plant. Green, red, 
I feel like I'm like in art school, but I can't draw, but I'm interested in the colors. I feel like green and red go together, right? Totally, Molly. I'm talking what? color theory right now. You're supposed to be helping me out. Don't you remember stuff like red and green go together, right? Yeah, right. Of course. What? <laughs> and then come forward again. And then come on this side of the plant. Fixed it. All right, and then excuse. Yeah. Good. Perfect. Yes. I should measure the light. <laughs> Everything the light touches. All right, and one, two, and three. Lift. I know it feels weird, but in the picture, it looks like it works. <laughs> All right. That was great. Let's do it again. I wasn't ready. <laughs> Deep inhale and exhale. That's great. Let's do it again. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Let me get you like kind of like I'm gonna put you in these trees, right? Yeah. Cause I feel like I need to. Kind of like, yeah, put like a hand here. Yeah. And let's delegate the flower. And then put the lights like here. That's dark. Two and three. Mm. Let's just have you drop your, drop your height. And then tilt your head to, like tilt your chin down a little bit and then lift your eyes. Yeah, yeah. And one, two, and three. Explain what you're doing. I don't mean explain all the technical things like, oh, I'm at this f-stop and I'm at this shutter speed. I don't mean get that technical about it. Let your subject know their frame. If I'm shooting a wide, medium, or a tight close-up shot, I tend to let my subject know what I have in frame. This way they can kind of relax or adjust themselves. I also like to tell them what I'm thinking for a shot. That's great. Keep looking like that. No, that way, yeah. <laughs> All right, and one, two, and three. It's like Rose on the boat. towards this plant. Oh, look closer in here. All right. I'm talking. Oh, the one sorry. closest to you, like closer. This one? Yeah. yeah. All right. And one, two, and three. All right. Can you like sit there and then put your feet here? Now take this. Thank you. Yep. Totally natural. Put it down real fast. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Jokes. They go a long way. They break a lot of ice if there's ice to be broken. But I understand everyone's not funny. And if you're not funny, I'm not pushing you to be funny or to go too far outside yourself. But if you're hanging out with your friend, then just make conversation if you're not a funny person. I just happen to be lucky enough that I have a few jokes. I have a few jokes. Sometimes they land, sometimes they don't. Typically, because I am able to have the jokey rapport with my friends, we end up having a lot of laughs on my shoots and I'm able to get natural laughs and photograph them. If you're not funny, that's okay. Just work on your conversation skills. But if you're shooting your friend, then you should have some conversation. And if not, I don't know what to say for you, really. Um, it's tough, man. If you don't have conversation in your toolkit, work on that. That's an important skill to have just as a photographer or anyone in general. Conversation is important to me. I, I hold it up there. And character traits that I enjoy in people. So yeah, chat. How can we cut this bit? So turn your chin more this way. Ah, there it is. And then step forward one step, step backwards. One more tiny step. Great. 
We found it. So we're gonna be super tight on your face. But not that tight. Well, it's not bad. You close your eyes. Deep inhale. Exhale. That was good. Now give me like a framing your face with your hands. Or like a natural, like a voguing kind of 90s way. Just like, you know, like a... <laughs> <laughs> like you're sub framing yourself okay. or like a two like this I'm gonna okay. go kind of just play around now okay. say what I like <laughs> switch hands this hand like yeah this yeah hand. then put this hand like here then oh, this hand can go here <laughs> no <laughs> Okay, try this hand back. Cause this hand's in the shadow, so that's good. Oh, okay. And then this hand, we don't want to block the light. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's get closer, kind of see. So yeah, put this on your shoulder. Yeah. Yeah. And then it's, maybe just put it through your hair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. He figured it out. All right. And one. People are walking. Two. Look this way. And boom. I can dig it. All right. Oh yeah. Give me like a hand up. Yep. Yeah. The the torso. Oh, spread your fingers. There you come. Hmm. Hmm. Nah. <laughs> that was a thought. Okay. Turn that way. Hmm. Turn back this way. Dip your chin this way. And then just kind of look up when you're ready. Nice. And the wind was like cooperating yeah, with was. us on that yeah. one. On sets in LA. Sorry. They're <laughs> unpredictable. She was both like, just all the way back. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And then angle your torso. That, yeah, that way, yeah. And my head back to you. Right? Yeah. Steadiness, one. I'm not supposed to be still. Okay, one, two, and three. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. That is it. I shot one roll of film with my friend Molly, and hopefully along the way, you can pick up some of the tips and tricks I use to kind of put us both at ease to make the situation less awkward and more fun, like we're just hanging out, having a regular day out at a park. Comment down below if you have any questions. Also share any tips you have for photographing your friends or convincing them to be in your photographs in the first place. All right, everybody, peace. Yeah, I'm gonna lose it. Ah, oh, Oh, sorry. Oh, well, we got two shots. Come back down. You'll see I tell Molly that I'm really interested in these bushes and I want to put her in the bush. And that's weird. <laughs>